Let's revisit how Michael Jackson's Thriller era set the pop industry standard. Younger singers, from Justin Timberlake to Usher and Chris Brown, have emulated his dance moves, his look and his sound. He was, for many, the ultimate performer. His influence feels like something that is instilled and embedded in anyone who wanted to create anything musically, said Marcia Ambrosius, one half of the duo Floetry that wrote the single, Butterflies. That single appeared on Jackson's 2001, Invincible, album. He will always be the king of pop, and no one will ever be able to fill those shoes with those shiny socks and that glove, Ambrosius said. For many of the younger generation, he was the first to not just cross over but explode onto the pop charts from the R&B scene. His phenomenal talent and worldwide appeal made his throne one to be aspired to even as they stood in awe of him. If you're a singer and you don't want to be like Michael Jackson, something is wrong, said singer and rapper Sean Kingston, who scored a hit in 2007 with the song, Beautiful Girls. He's a huge influence. Sonia Murray, a longtime Atlanta-based music columnist, said Jackson was for the younger set what James Brown had been for Jackson, an inspiration. It was the many dimensions he had as a performer. Michael looks to James Brown and Sammy Davis Jr. and for the younger guys, he was the closest thing they had. His music videos were must-see TV, and aspiring artists learned that it took more than just holding a microphone if they really wanted to make it big. He was the total package, said Gail Mitchell, senior editor for R&B and hip-hop for Billboard. Steve Greenberg, founder and CEO of S-Curve Records, was a disc jokey in Tel Aviv, Israel, when Thriller first dropped and witnessed firsthand how Jackson became an international icon. Greenberg said Jackson influenced everyone who has come after him. He's been around so long that everyone on the contemporary scene has come after him, Greenberg said. His was the first very contemporary, very exciting dance music to emerge after the death of disco. His was a global appeal, among fans and artists worldwide. He was as big in the Middle East and Southeast Asia as he was in America and Europe. He had that universality that not many people had. The Beatles had it, Muhammad Ali had it, but not many other people have had it. His music also crossed genres. He was a favorite of rappers to sample and working with him was a badge of honor in the industry. Producer Dallas Austin worked with him on Michael Jackson's history, past, present and future and, like the rest of the world, was stunned by his death. Michael Jackson was a magical person to work with, Austin said in a released statement. I am saddened by his death. The world won't be the same without him. Even for the most hardcore in hip-hop, there was no shame in admitting love for the king of pop. Michael Jackson has always been an inspiration to me as far as his music is concerned, rapper Snoop Dogg told MTV in 2001. You can't take nothing from him. Wyclef Jean released a statement saying, Michael Jackson was my musical god. He made me believe that all things are possible, and through real and positive music, he can live forever, Gene said. I love Michael Jackson. God bless him. Floetry member Marcia Ambrosius said she felt blessed to have spent two weeks working with Jackson in New York City after he fell in love with a song she had written. She had the opportunity to get to know him, not just as a superstar, but as a fun-loving family man who stayed in touch with her even after the project was finished. He was one of the most amazing people you would ever want to meet, she said. I can say I worked with the most incredible artist on planet Earth. Michael Jackson's charity work has always inspired me. Michael often expressed his dedication to helping those in need. He visited hospitals, made generous donations, and also implemented programs to help the sick, the poor, and the less fortunate. Not only did Michael master the art of performing, song and dance, he also mastered the art of philanthropy. On the official Michael Jackson website, it reads, In 2000, Guinness World Records honored Michael for supporting 39 charities, a record for the most supported by a pop star, with hundreds of millions of dollars estimated to have been raised by his efforts. Although Michael had an outstanding dedication to being charitable and giving both money and time to help those in need, his humanitarianism is seldom discussed. When I came across this book, Humanitarian, The Real Michael Jackson, I knew it was something I'd be interested in. Written by Paul Dwyer, this book is a chronological timeline that goes into detail on much of Michael's charitable work throughout the years. Starting out in his days with the Jackson 5 at Motown and all the way up to the last year of his life, in 2009. Before I go over some of my favorite parts of the book, I also think it's pertinent to mention how the book was created in the spirit of Michael's charity work. The author funded the setup, publishing, and website himself and also all of the profits of book sales go to a local children's hospital that Michael visited. Something about the background behind the book really inspires me because it really shows how influential Michael Jackson the humanitarian has been. The author Paul Dwyer starts the book and shares how he became a fan, hailing from Australia, 
he saw Michael in concert many times, met him, and has been very impacted by Michael. I think it was very honorable of him to write a book honoring this part of Michael's life and he does a great job of documenting as many events and instances of charity work as possible. All of the stories are well researched, many with photos as well. There are so many stores where Michael has personally visited the besides of sick children, starting with his time in the Jackson 5, as early as March 1973. As a Michael Jackson fan, there are a number of stories that I am familiar with already. I know that when Michael Jackson was burned in that Pepsi commercial taping, that he visited with many hospitalized even at that time. And then shortly thereafter he began the Michael Jackson burn center at the hospital where he was treated. With a generous donation of $1.5 million. Some other highlights include. We are the world, which raised over 150 million US dollars after inflation for humanitarian causes, mostly Africa relief including agriculture, reforestation, and water management. Michael visited many people who felt that he gave them an extra shot at recovery or even an extended lease on life. He visited elementary schools and donated tens of thousands to better their programs, in addition to the Michael Jackson Scholarship Fund which still exists today. He worked with the Make-A-Wish Foundation and even established his own Heal the World Foundation in the 90s. A lot of people don't know this but, it's also outlined in Michael's will that 10% of all income from his estate be donated to charity so, his humanitarianism lives on. I recommend this book to anyone who is new to Michael Jackson and his humanitarian side but also to fans who just never knew in detail what he actually did. Triumphs in Music Born on August 29, 1958, in Gary, Indiana, Michael Jackson displayed immense talent from a young age. As the lead singer of the Jackson 5, a group comprising him and his siblings, he captivated audiences with his powerful voice, dazzling dance moves, and undeniable charisma. The group's success, signed under Motown Records, skyrocketed in the late 1960s and early 1970s, producing hits like I Want You Back and ABC. However, it was Michael Jackson's solo career that propelled him to global superstardom. His fifth studio album, Off the Wall, 1979, marked a turning point, earning him his first Grammy Award for the single, Don't Stop, Till You Get Enough. But it was his record-breaking album, Thriller, 1982, that made him a global sensation. The album's title track, along with other hits like Billie Jean and Beat It, solidified Jackson's position as a music icon and broke racial barriers in the music industry. Moonwalk and Dance Legacy Beyond his extraordinary vocals, Michael Jackson was a groundbreaking dancer. He introduced the world to the iconic Moonwalk during a performance of Billie Jean at the Motown 25, Yesterday, Today, Forever Special in 1983. The moonwalk became synonymous with Jackson and is still considered one of the most influential dance moves in history. His innovative choreography, combined with his charisma, set new standards for stage performances, inspiring countless artists and dancers around the world. His music videos, including the 14-minute epic Thriller video, revolutionized the music video genre, turning them into powerful storytelling tools. Controversies and Legal Battles while Michael Jackson's music and performances brought joy to millions, his personal life was marred by controversies and legal battles. In the 90s, he faced allegations of child molestation, which led to two highly publicized trials. In both cases, he was acquitted of all charges, but the controversies had a significant impact on his public image and took a toll on his mental and physical health. Despite these challenges, Jackson remained devoted to his music and philanthropy. He continued to release successful albums and engage in humanitarian efforts, including supporting various charitable causes and organizing fundraising events for children's charities. Enduring Legacy Michael Jackson's legacy is undeniably enduring. He holds the record for the best-selling album of all time with Thriller, and his influence on pop music, dance, and fashion continues to be felt in contemporary artists' work. His philanthropic efforts have also left a lasting impact, inspiring others to use their influence to make a positive difference in the world. Though his life was cut short tragically on June 25, 2009, at the age of 50, his music and cultural impact remain alive. Michael Jackson's artistry, dance moves, and humanitarian work have made an indelible mark on the world, and his music continues to resonate with new generations of fans. Michael Jackson's life was a roller coaster of triumphs, controversies, and an enduring legacy that will forever be etched in the annals of music history. His journey from a child prodigy to the king of pop is a testament to his unmatched talent, innovation, and determination. As we remember him, let us celebrate his musical genius, his contributions to the world of entertainment, and his humanitarian spirit.
Michael Jackson's influence will continue to shape the world of music and inspire future generations of artists to reach for greatness.